how to find the best route that the router is going to choose. So when a router a, receives a frame, and I actually get uh, some notes here. So when a router receives a frame, it removes the packet from inside the frame and decides where to forward the packet. Uh, puts the packet into the into another frame and sends the frame. Um, <clears throat> decides where to forward the packet. That is actually the 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 major step that the router is doing when it you know when it's doing routing. So that's what we are going to talk about in this video. How a router decides how a router uh, finds the best uh, route and <clears throat> and how uh, we as network engineers uh, can actually find it you know ourselves uh, easier so I actually got a topology here and this is the topology that Topology that I've been using uh, in the uh, uh, for the last videos for the last four or three videos that I have been I have created. So <clears throat> there's actually two uh, commands, and, and one of the command is show IP route, and that's the command that you can use to for you to check the uh, the router uh, routing table. So I'm actually actually uh, on the core right now. So uh, you know this is our core core and it's connected to R1 and R2 and R2, R1 and R2 are both connected to ISP and ISP is connected to the cloud or the internet. And of course uh, down here uh, the core switch is connected to both uh, switch one and switch two and we got a uh, Ubuntu Docker one connected to switch one and Ubuntu Docker two connected to uh, switch two. So I'm now on the core switch. So like I said uh, for you to check the uh, device routing table in this case this is actually a multi-layer switch but uh, I mean, you know, uh, as you know, multi-layer switch uh, does switch, does routing as well. So if you do a show IP route, this is the routing table. This is the uh, routing table of this device. So this is one way uh, for you to check the the best route that the router is uh, gonna choose. Uh, and of course, uh, the router is going to choose the most specific route, or in other words, the route that has the longest prefix length. <clears throat> prefix length. So, for example, uh, this this uh, device here, Ubuntu Docker One, if you know for for some reason it uh, it it's got a a packet or yeah, a packet, and that packet has a destination IP of this device here, Ubuntu Docker 2. Uh, <clears throat> uh, the router is gonna is gonna look at the uh, destination MAC destination IP address and choose the and chooses the best or the most specific route. So in that um, in our example, the IP address would be this IP address. Uh, actually that 12. So let me go to Ubuntu Docker 2 and do a this is Linux so the command is ifconfig so the IP address of this Docker is 10.0.11.12 so we just have to do some subnutting, subnutting math in this example so uh, <clears throat> we're just gonna check where this 
where this uh, IP address, or in our case, destination MAC ad destination IP address be uh, belongs to. So we're going to look at its uh, network. So in this example, its network ID is slash 24. So, so 10.0.11. So that would be this route. So it's actually directly connected to uh, the core switch. And that interface is VLAN slash uh, VLAN 14. So if we do a show run interface VLAN 14, that's where the uh, subnet is configured. So here. So that's why it says here directly connected. So that's one way uh, for you to check the best route that the router or in this case the multi-layer switch is gonna choose. But there's actually a better and uh, easier way to find out the best route that the <clears throat> uh, layer three device is going to choose, and that uh, command, and that way is using the command show IP route uh, address. Show so here, IP host name or IP address. So in our case, I'm going to actually get the destination IP address, which is Ubuntu Docker 2, and enter. So it says here, routing entry for this subnet, or this route. And this route, uh, it says here that it's known via connected. And distance, admin distance, I believe, zero, metric zero. Uh, via connected via interface and this is actually the so directly connected this is the outgoing interface right so that's actually a better way to find out uh, the best route that the uh, layer 3 is going to choose to forward that uh, packet let me actually go to R1 and let me see yeah so R1, I'm actually going to get this uh, Ubuntu Docker 1 IP address. And it's got this IP address. And let's see uh, what what is the route that this R1 is going to choose to forward the, let's say that, you know, we receive a, a frame and... <clears throat> Uh, or packet, and that packet has a MAC address of that, I mean, has a uh, destination, I, destination IP address of this IP address. Uh, we can actually go ahead and sh do sh a show IP route. And it says here that uh, <clears throat> this is, it says here, routing entry for here, so this is actually the the best route or the most specific route. So if you go, if if you do a show IP route um, for here, this is the this is the route that has the most uh, or the longest uh, prefix length in the uh, R1 routing table. Longest prefix length, yes. So slash 21. So this this IP address here belongs to this uh, subnet, and it's known via static uh, distance one metric zero. It's being advertised by BGP, and this is actually the next hop IP address. So this next hop IP address is actually core one. I mean the core switch. So I'm gonna do a show IP interface brief, and as you can see here, that's the 
uh, uh, IP address that is configured on VLAN 5 interface. Which, uh, let me actually do a show IP neighbor neighbors. I mean show CDP neighbors. <clears throat> Sorry. So. Okay, so yeah, it's just showing the physical interfaces. So the core switch is connected to R1 using uh, this interface and to R2 using this interface. So again, um, there's actually two ways to figure out the best route that the uh, layer three device is gonna choose. And one of them is using the command show IP route. Um, like I said, uh, with this command, you have to do some, some subnetting math. But uh, with the show IP route and the address or the destination IP address, uh, it's gonna show you the the uh, the best route, and you don't have to do some subnetting math. So uh, it's <clears throat> recommended to use this uh, uh, command to find the best route that uh, you know the 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 layer three device is gonna choose. So, yep, that's it in this video. Thanks for watching.